Okay, okay I'm recording. I'm recording again. Okay, welcome back, guys. They're doing more trial shit, so I'm just showing it off. Wait, I think this is uh, Pikachu. I think this is Pokemon. Oh shit, we're about to see more Pokemon stuff. <laughs> And translating for him, we have David along with Evie. Right, that's gonna be crazy, dude. And this is Teresa, we're from Nintendo. Oh shit, I see the Pokeball Joy Cons. Uh, before we begin playing Masuda-san, I wanted to hear from you, and I think everybody would like to hear from you. First, what are, what are your goals in designing and developing? I cannot wait, Let's Anthony. Go and Pokemon Let's go Eevee. Is her Joy-Con connected to a cord? Everyone ever. Right. That's what pissed me off too. His final smash is a sword, yeah. I mean, his forward smash, sorry. Oh, I didn't see that. Supersonic is actually literally supersonic in terms of speed. Supersonic. <laughs> Giga Bowser has a fucking Falcon Punch, dude. I don't know, man. I don't know if it's the best. It's good, though. What would a Pokemon for everyone be? Everybody has their own voice too. Man, this game. I can't believe every character is back. I also had in mind a lot of the younger kids maybe don't have their own smartphones to play Pokemon Go. There's so many people out there playing Pokemon Go, but some of the younger kids maybe didn't get a chance to do that. So I had them in mind, as well as all of our existing fans, really wanting this to be truly a Pokemon for everyone. Great, well, why don't we take a look at the game and show the world Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. Oh, shit. Charmander! Oh my god, this looks so good! Damn the detail, man! This looks so good. I'm gonna be right back, guys. Just give me a second. I'm trying to load up the This may be a familiar location for a lot of our fans that played the older games, but they're kind of come back to life in 3D here. Yeah, so it looks Essie. wonderful. You can see Pokemon out in the field. Um, you can see the shafts of light. Also, if you walk up to them, it starts it. Okay. So you just walk up to them. You can't avoid them. You still have to battle them or whatever. Okay. All right, here we go. Pokemon Go horse shit. Nine nine nine. Somebody's using cheats. <laughs> nine 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 Pokeballs. Somebody's using Poke Hex. <laughs> Was that not an excellent throw? Getting that ball! Getting that ball! Up until now in the Pokemon games, the wild Pokemon you encounter, you go into a battle and then you kind of reduce their hit points, weaken them a bit, and then you're able to catch them. But with these games, this uh, music, Nintendo Switch, and this of music, in the living room, you figured people would be playing along with. How is that not an excellent throw from before, though? This kind of Pokemon catching experience with these intuitive right, cool. controls, where you're just kind of flicking the Nintendo Switch controller and throwing out Pokeballs. Bonus multiplier? You get experience points for... Huh? What? What the f... Your whole team? What the fucking shit?
accepted and kind of this is a confusing. Lot of popularity. So I wanted to do a take on that using the Joy-Con uh, to a similar style where it's much more interactive and kind of a experiential. Thing. Anthony, yeah, so you do you. I'm I'm going to the Joy-Con right and Teresa is playing with a single Joy-Con. You're able to play the entire game with just one Joy-Con. The Ima Joy-Con no hanashi wa demashita kero mo jitsu wa Joy-Con katate de asoberu yoru natte masu yo ne. Subete no tsuosa ga dekiru yoru natte masu. Kore yuta no kaiteki de ano mina san ano popcorn o tabe nagara katate de game ga asoberu tte yu desu ne. Kigaru kan ga nan tomo ii to moemasu. Yeah, I think having one Joy-Con being able to play the entire game with it is a very comfortable and kind of a pleasurable experience. You can maybe be eating popcorn. This is the last one, I'm pretty sure. And I also say that when you capture wild Pokemon, you earn experience points, and those get uh, shared among the entire Pokemon in your party. I'm saying this is the last one, period. <laughs> Uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, whatever. I'm gonna believe what I'm gonna believe, and I believe Sakurai is done after this point. You're gaining experience points, of course, levels up the Pokemon in your party, gives them, gets them stronger. So that's how you kind of, you know, strengthen your Pokemon. It's the main mechanic of that. Wait, shiny Metapod? What? That catching experience. So made sure that you can also. I'm, your I'm still gonna attention. talk. You can talk though. And I think you also can do different throwing motions to try to catch Pokemon as well. The Pokemon no, ano, tsukamae ru toki no nagekata mo iro iro kufu shite masu yo ne. So, ano, nanamei ni furuto nanamei ni bolton detari, ano, yoko kara ko yoko ni side thrust suru to, ano, yoko ni ton detari to, sono, ma, damn, you love that. Sai no koro wa amari Pokemon goi te nai desu kedo, kouhan naru to Pokemon ga gokki dasu nde, sore ni awasete iron na nagekata de, teknik de, mina san no teknik wo, ano, yeah, you can do a variety of uh, throwing techniques. Like if you can put a little bit of an angle on it to throw diagonally Pikachu. or throw to the side or even do an underhand lob type of thing. And right now in these early parts of the game, you'll see that the Pokemon aren't moving around very much. But later on, they're going to be moving around. So you're going to need to try a lot of different techniques. Oh. Female Pikachu. It looks like a uh, female Pikachu. Jose Bajo, this name. So, this is Tokyo to Tokyo no Morito Yeba, ma, Pikachu on Skiro. I think Viridian Forest, you know, Pikachu is well known for this location. So, Teresa, do you want to try a uh, side throw or something like that? Yeah, it's definitely. Side throw. Yeah, because Pikachu is a little bit more of a challenge to catch, I'm going to switch to an Ultra Ball. あ、じゃあ、あの、サイドスローをちょっと試してみますけれども、ピカチュウがより、えっと、捕まえにくいので、ウルトラボールの方に変えます。ちょっと斜めに行きましたね。はい、ウルトラボールのほうに変えます。
、えー、トレーナー同士でバトルをするという楽しみは、えーまあ、とても大事ですし、yeah. あとはあの通信対戦と、まあ、同じような<笑>、えー、形で。やっぱりこう人と人が、えー、それぞれのポケモンを持って、えー、勝負をするというのは、えー、まあそこのポイントは抑えています。<笑>ね、<笑>ポケモンの戦いの中で、えー、それぞれのポケモンを持って、えー、まあ、それぞれのポケモンを持って、えー、それぞれのポケモンを持って、それぞれのポケモンを持って、それぞれのポケモンを持って、それぞれのポケモンを持って、それぞれのポケモンを持って、それぞれのポケモンを持って、それぞれのポケモンを持って、それぞれのポケモンを持って、So there's some weird stuff with this. So in these games, you'll see that there's quite a difference between the catching gameplay, which you're using the Joy-Con to flick out and throw, actually throw out Pokeballs, and then the battle gameplay, which is more traditional selecting commands to fight,、uh, issue moves, and、uh, battle the enemy. Yeah, 999、yeah, fucking balls. Yeah, and I think we also we see the Pokemon in the grass. We've even seen. In,、uh, with some of the Pokemon, that there are graphic indicators, some kind of aura around the Pokemon. Oh, is that correct?、Oh. That smash is loud as fuck. What the hell? So if you run into your Pokemon, he goes into his Pokeball. That's silly. We, we did this to really make it so you players would want to catch、like, even a bunch of the same species of Pokemon, so there's a little bit of differentiators there. Like,、uh, red I'm gonna check it out in a little bit. I'm, just watch, I'm still watching Pokemon Go. They're much smaller than normal. What the fuck is Pikachu's tail? Pikachu's tail, calm down. Pikachu's tail. Oh, is Pikachu an item finder? Are you kidding me? Pikachu is an item finder. What? 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 So it looks like the redesign <laughs> of the Kanto region that, that you've, 3D, you've really taken that into account. Oh my god. Items throughout the world. That is cute as fuck. <laughs> oh shit. <sighs> oh fuck. <laughs> So, is Eevee gonna wag its ears?、Uh, Damn, who is that girl? Somebody said Shad Bad. <laughs> Y'all need to calm down. Y'all need to calm down. The game just started showing these characters. Don't do this. Shad Bad, please don't do it. Don't do it, Shad Bad. <laughs> Lass. Oh, she's got some sass for a lass. Oh, she's got sass. She's like, ugh, let me twirl my hair in, in disgust. Oh, I love this game. The details, dude. I'm sorry I shitted on you when you first were revealed. I'm sorry. You're, you're a good game. Even if you are super crazy simple. I can't wait to buy this. I can't, I can't wait to play this. So, the ones with the red aura, I guess they're like harder to get or something? This is gonna be crazy. They, they are in the tall grass, but they can come out. Oddish. Somebody said a shiny wink whirlpool, and I'm like, I'm a shiny uh, uh, we weedle, and I'm like, what? This music is fucking tight. Dog with the 99 Pokeballs, though. Somebody is hacking. <laughs> 
So I see we're in another wild Pokemon battle with uh, Teresa doing an underthrow there. Mm. Mm. Wow, what an easy catch. Yeah, you did a good job there. Thank you. <laughs> I'm so good at Pokemon. I'm stop. <laughs> That's me. I shouldn't make fun. I can't believe every time you catch a Pokemon, you level up now instead of having to fight them. I mean, in X and Y, if you caught a Pokemon without fighting it, did you get experience? I don't remember. I think you did. I gotta look it up. So maybe that's not as different. I gotta look that up. When you press the kind of get in position button. It resets the, gyro the reason I said that is because I've been playing Crystal recently and I kind of fucking forgot. Doing that, depending on where you're holding the controller at the time, can allow you to do a variety of different things. But of course, when you're, you can also play the game handheld mode if you decide to take it off the TV. Um, and in that case, you're able to play with button controls. Fucking miss. In handheld mode, it's a slightly different style of gameplay where you're actually taking the entire system itself and using the gyro. Double kick? Wait a minute! Pikachu didn't learn double kick? What is that? That's a new fucking move. Pikachu never learned double kick. So, but I think we Did Pikachu learn double kick, guys? Another mode that perhaps we I'm pretty about, fucking that sure that's new. It's not a new game, though. <laughs> uh, I'm making a joke. Wow! Dog, we're gonna see some new movesets today. What the fuck, double kick? What does it even need that for? In the bottom right of the screen, or actually in the right of the screen in the battle mode, you may have just seen that, but it indicates that. Go back to go back to Gen One real quick and tell me if double kick is in his move set. Oh shit, the second player. The cute girl, the girl I will be playing as. So I am now playing together with Teresa. Wow, it's a brand new wow dog. Okay, so they're gonna show off the double Pokeball throw. I'm pretty sure you can only customize Pikachu and Eevee, the ones that you get in the beginning of the game. Wow. <laughs> and it still broke out! Fucking garbage! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking garbage! <laughs> it still broke out! <laughs> so does it not equal a great ball then? Okay, now, it, now it's in. Or I, I would have thought maybe like a critical capture, but maybe that's too easy. Oh no, it wasn't a critical capture because critical capture shakes one time and it's done, so that's not it. I guess it's just like a, the multiplier or whatever. That's gonna be man. I can't. I'm actually <sighs> Nintendo won 2018. I don't care about E3. They won 2018. <laughs> wow, we get Smash and Pokemon, man. I saw. I heard Eevee. Eevee has its anime voice, by the way. It doesn't go, <laughs> it goes, <laughs> and why? It's going to be so sick. Why you run? Why did you run? Catch these Pokemons. So she can go ahead of you and run into Pokemon, but don't fight them? Okay. I mean, that's all right. I guess this is your adventure. 
So in a trainer battle, um, both players. So is this a double battle? Well, and that can be a big help for somebody who's more of a. Oh no, it's not a double battle. But she did bring out her. What the fuck? Two on one? That's cheating! The Pokemon Rule League rules say only one Pokemon at a time. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually cheating! What is this shit? Oh my god, look at her pose. Oh, she's ready. Oh, yes! 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 Why would you use... I mean, okay, I get why they did double kick to, to show off the, the two-player aspect. But I'm like, why would you use double kick and not quick attack? Fucking two, two on one battles! <laughs> Some cheating horse shit! <laughs> ah, this is crazy! <laughs> uh, I mean, yeah, yeah, but fucking, this is so mean. This guy's getting bullied by these two kids. <laughs> How did she get a Bulbasaur though? But wait a minute. How, how, do, how do you determine what Pokemon she gets? Or was that already in your party? Because every Pokemon he catches, it goes in his bag apparently. Which is really weird. So I'm, there's so much confusion right now in my head. So the Pokemon in you catch don't go to the PC, they go to your bag. But she gets a Bulbasaur, but does that mean the Bulbasaur was already in the bag? I'm... <laughs> Wait, I saw a Squirtle. Or does he have a Bulbasaur? Oh, maybe he had a Bulbasaur. Okay, he, no, 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 he has all the starters of Onix and, and something else. So that's why. But why is Bulbasaur not following her? Yeah, yeah, there's the Bulbasaur. That's why. Okay. But why is Squirtle following her and not Bulbasaur? Unless you have to assign it. Take out of Pokeball. Oh, that's how it works. Oh, cool. Communication. Communicate. Oh, that's online. You can go to online straight from the start menu? Oh my god, look at that. So wait, she has to walk? She can't ride the Onyx? Man, that's some horse shit. She can't ride the Onyx. So he goes right... Why? I like how... Man, they could have did this in Sun and Moon. Come on. They just go right into the Pokeball if you go into like a small area. They could have did this in Sun and Moon. Come on, man. Are you kidding me? They could have had... Oh, fuck it. They just... Game Freak, you make me mad sometimes. You really do. Because the, the walking animations are in Sun and Moon. They could have... If they are just going to go back in the Pokeball every time they go into an area they can't get to, you could have did this in Sun and Moon. Uh, whatever. I get it. You want money. I understand. It's fine. Whatever. Fuck it. I don't care. But you're going to see that our animators got really creative with some of the Pokemon. For example, like Electrode, instead of walking, it's going to be rolling behind you like a ball. <laughs> yeah, I love I love the fact that Electro rolls. So it looks like I can't wait to see uh, Komala, because Komala rolls on its log and just goes... She just flew out of the screen. <laughs> she actually flew away! Tracer? Wait, who is this? This is a new character. Why he look like a Pokemon Go character? Is this your rival? Tra oh, his name's Trace. Tracy? Nani? <laughs> that's, that, that's not Tracy. That's not Tracy. God, I am so happy right now. I'm in bliss, if you guys don't know. Smash, Smash has every character back and every stage back. New Final so Smashes. It's actually competitive. Pokemon Go looks amazing. <laughs> and both of them are coming out this year. I'm in bliss. Uh, 
This is actually the best year. I think that's your rival. So we've added some new events to the games compared to the originals and also changed up the characters a bit to make them kind of feel fresh. That's great. Well, Teresa, he doesn't look like a dickhead, though. He looks like uh, a, few battles. Maybe um, a nice rival again, which means we're not going to get, you know, a dickhead yeah, rival. Um, Here goes the Pokemon Center. Wow, look at this. This looks so good. Damn, this looks good. This, this is giving me Pokemon XD vibes. <laughs> I'm getting some real Pokemon XD vibes by this. Like, holy shit. I like how Pikachu jumps off your shoulder. And the anime. It kind of reminds me of the anime, too. Holy shit. Wait, did Poke Pikachu not go in his Pokeball? Or maybe he did. I, I, it went so fast I didn't even pay attention. They said something. You may have seen in the, the Pokemon Center, we made sure to keep the original pixel art. Not the original, but the pixel art for the Pokemon uh, appearing on the screen there. Oh, yeah, the pixel art. I noticed that. That was pretty cool. The, wait, the map. The map. The map. <laughs> shit. I wanted to see if there was anything new. Oh, go back to the map. No. We still want to keep them in Game. That's right. That's okay. I got game explain. Game explain is gonna have to go fucking overtime this week. You see lots of residents of the town. What the walking around living with their Pokemon? Yeah, the town. I think they do because that's a big slowpoke. Remember, we we don't get Waylord until Gen three, so we're not gonna see anything from Gen after Gen one. What's the biggest Pokemon in Gen one? Kangaskhan? Kangaskhan's pretty big. Mewtwo's pretty big. Mewtwo's actually pretty big. We saw Mewtwo. Mewtwo is pretty big. Uh, Charizard's big. Onyx. Well, on there you go. Just look at Onyx. We saw Onyx, right? Onyx is life size. So I'm pretty sure they are. <laughs> Onyx is huge. I mean, sure, that was outside of battle, but still. I'm pretty sure Onyx is huge in Battle 2. I don't know why it would be. <laughs> Whaler's gonna be fucking. Whaler's gonna constantly go in and out of its Pokeball every time. Wait, what's happening? What's happening? Cutscene. Slowpoke is staring blankly ahead. You spend a relaxing time with Slowpoke. And then you're the other girl's over there floating off in space off the steps. Why is she floating off the steps? <sighs> There's some stuff about these games. I get what they're doing. I get it. The game's unfinished and all that. But if that stuff's in the final game, it's going to be bad. <laughs> it's going to be not as good. She was literally floating on the steps, though. They're trying to get more realistic, but you guys, come on now. Are we about to fight Brock? Oh, shit! Oh, shit! We're about to fight Brock! Wait, we got Spectre? Dude! This is so sick! So that's what that guy looked like. Like, hey, new trainer, welcome. I, I believe in you. You're gonna do a good job. So that's what he looks like. Hit me with that fresh water. <laughs> Look at Brock, though. In the, I, can, I can see him in the distance and he looks good. So wait, they gave Pikachu double kick just so you can make Brock's battle easy? Are you kidding me? <laughs> That's why they gave Pikachu double kick. Damn it! So Eevee gets Iron Tail then, right? Or Iron Head. What if he gets Iron Head? It's it's probably gonna get Iron Tail. So the guy was asking you if you had a Water or Grass type Pokemon. It has to. Um, that's a TM. Wait! Don't avoid the battle. Come on! They fucking avoided the battle. Awesome dickheads. Are you kidding me? We're, we, we're about to body you because it's a 2 1 1 battle. That's cr that No, that's fair. Brock would totally do that. That's a fair battle. They're too iconic. I'd be sad if they weren't there. Double kick. This is exactly why you double kick. <laughs> I understand. I understand. Like, oh, what if I don't want to catch any Pokemon? It goes straight to Brock. 
Uh, I mean, you have to. In, oh. Well, in order to even nice. get double kick, so you have to fight a couple mm -hmm. Pokemon in order to learn that move. Damn, look at that Vine Whip animation. That was pretty sick. It's nice to be able to battle together. My video is still uploading and it's still taking 34 minutes, but it hasn't yet to be flagged. I don't think it's been flagged. Let me see. It's probably going to get flagged, though. I'm anticipating the flag. It's really satisfying and really immersive experience. So, this is a trainer battle that is not the interaction of the Joy-Con. Bobs are learning Lee Seed. Give me a soul. Oh my god. Tess. Tess. Yeah, we really thought that the are you watching? The Joy -Cons are, really cool technology. We put a lot of care into are you still watching Pokemon? Dude, I'm about to play. This is. The, I, I don't even want to go to work tomorrow. I'm about to play Fortnite Paladins. I'm still watching this craziness. What a time to be alive, man. What a time. Why does she fly off into the distance? <laughs> Wait, she's not going to. You don't get the 2v1 Brock? That's lame! What? <laughs> you can't two v one the gym. What? <laughs> but you can two v one the trainers. That's lame. <laughs> no, I want to see the gym. I want to see the gym battle. What are you doing? Go back. Oh my voice. God, I gotta get the water. Hold on. Oh my god. Oh man. Oh shit. And the Pokeball Plus is oh. says Joy-Con. It has all the functionality. It's got a, a control stick uh, that you can press down, um, and even a button on the top. Can you use it in any other game? Though? <laughs> I want that. E I want that EV plush. Make sure you put on your wrist straps. It's stronger. Oh. You're, you're just getting back, Anthony? Yeah, we've been talking, and uh, they've been showing off Pokemon. He just got to uh, the fight Brock, and they haven't done it yet, so they, they went off screen. Hopefully they show up. They're probably not going to, though. I can't wait to put... Oh, my God. Ugh. I'm getting this in Smash Day 1. I'm actually going to buy Smash as a cartridge, though. Normally, I wouldn't. I would get it digitally, but... Man, okay, maybe I'll get it digitally. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Pokemon to put inside of the Pokeball Plus and players first get it, and deciding which Pokemon to put in there, we came up... Anthony, fucking fuck, wait, you can't do this. I'm still watching Pokemon stuff, damn it. hear Mew cry from inside of the ball, and it'll be an interesting experience. That's right, so then you can transfer that Mew into Which means Shadow's an unlockable character. Why would he be an assist trophy? Based on your if he's going to be an Echo Fighter. But no, he can't be an Echo Fighter. His moveset is... He, Shadow's moveset potential is too much to be an Echo Fighter. It, there's no way. He's going to be his own character. If he's an Echo Fighter, I will be very disappointed. Fucking Waluigi. I'm sad for Waluigi and Lin fans. I'm actually pretty sad. That was a whirlwind of emotions, dude. <laughs> I'm shaking it up close to my mic so everyone can hear. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, that's so cute. But what I really like about the Pokeball Plus controller is the weight, uh, the size, and actually it just it feels like so a Pokeball. Good. If only it expanded when you push the button in, like magic, like in the anime. I think we don't have the technology for that test. <laughs> Pokeball Plus is really nice.
But that would be cool. And the, the LED light that you can see at the, where the, the, the joystick is actually lights up in a really wide variety of colors and it kind of corresponds. You got everybody, man! I didn't think I was gonna get my fucking melee main again. Young Link, come on! I'm so happy about that. I'm so happy, man. Fuck. They brought everyone back. Shadow, shadow, shadow. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Wait, who was your melee main? Young Link? <laughs> Pichu, let's go. It's a Pokeball Plus, but when you connect with Pokemon Go, it works as a Pokemon Go Plus. That's right. So lots of. I'm so happy I got Young Link back, man. You don't fucking know. I'm doing both. Your adventure with another player to play. I'm recording all of this. You're also able to uh, battle and trade with other players. Maybe Mr. Masuda has more information on that feature. Holy fuck. The details in that game? Jeez, man, I can't. The details in that game are so fucking good. Sakura also said he wasn't going to do a competitive smash, and he fucking brought Wave Dashing back. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, no, no, he brought Battlefield version. Every stage is a compatible. Every stage is a competitive stage. Tournaments are gonna be, but I'm actually gonna enter tournaments. <laughs> I don't know who that is. That is that you? Oh wait, are they doing a Wi-Fi battle? Oh, they're showing how trading works. They're showing how Wi-Fi trading works. They're showing Pokemon uh, Let's Go Pikachu. And they're showing how trading works now. Yeah, they're showing how trading works. Attention! If the communication error happens, you will be banned! Wow, look at this animation. Wow, that animation was crisp. You can see that animation is kind of reminiscent of the maybe the link cable that you had to use to trade Pokemon back then. We just kind of digitized that into a cool trading sequence. Yeah, we just have good memories, fond memories of trading with that link cable. Wow. Great. But of course, not only can you trade Pokemon with other players, but you can also connect with Pokemon Go and you can send Pokemon from Pokemon Go into Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee. Okay, they're my Pokemon Go stuff. Oh, Shadowfire, download Fortnite when you're free. It's free. If everybody hasn't downloaded Fortnite now, please do so. It's fucking free. I'm gonna play Fortnite as the uh, Splatoon horse shit goes on. So yeah, I'll play that with you guys. Okay, now they're showing off Pikachu Eevee. I mean, uh, let's go Eevee. This is the this is the one I'm getting. <laughs> wait, wait. Oh shit. So this is the place you go to get your Pokemon Go stuff. Enter Go Park, enter Play Yard, bring Pokemon. What the fuck? What is the Go? Why are there so many different Go Parks? I mean, I guess you could have multiple accounts, but that's too many. Though. So these are the Pokemon from Pokemon Go. Show me. Oh God! Look how huge Kangaskhan is. Show me a Lolan Executor. Show me a Lolan Executor right now. Where is my long neck boy? 
I don't see him, damn it. <sighs> They're not showing him. Oh my shit, Moltres! Look at Gar look at Gyarados. You can definitely ride Gyarados. Holy shit, Gyarados is huge. I'm pretty sure you can ride Moltres too. All right, cool. Snorlax is standing the fuck up. <laughs> Snorlax is not lying down. Look at that big ass scared. Oh my. Oh, oh, can't wait. I can't wait for this shit, dude. You're going to take Hit My Lee? Catch Hit My So you still have to catch them. You can't just take them. Okay. All right. I mean, they did show that off, but it's, it should be easy. Are you going to still get Pokeballs or regular balls? Or like special Pokeballs? Well, if you want it to be in a. He moved. He moved. So after talking to him, they're able to choose the catch option, which brings in... So you can use different Pokeballs, but you only get the, what you call... Because you catch them in different balls in the actual game. Like, you can get Premier Balls in the other game, in Pokemon Go. That was a terrible throw. Throw it diagonally. There you go. And you'll see if you transfer over Pokemon from Pokemon Go that have a really high CP level, they'll appear in Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee at a pretty much a higher level. They'll be stronger. Oh, so the CP compares to what it's going to be in game? So that was a shit. First of all, first of all, level one Hitmonlee, what? <laughs> Is that even a thing? Can you have that? Is that real? If you breed Hitmonlee with anything else, does it get a Tyrogue or, or can it be a Hitmonlee? Guys? And you can receive Pokemon from Pokemon Go. It doesn't matter whose Pokemon Go it is. You can get them from friends, maybe a parent or grandparents. You can get a whole bunch of different Pokemon. Pokemon I have it up already. I'm losing my mind. Damn, Poliwhirl. From Pokemon Go to Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee, um, they leave your Pokemon Go, and in exchange, you would get some candies. What? Oh, so you get candy. That's good. How many candy do you get? I hope it's not the same amount when you transfer. That'd be dumb. It needs to be more. Like 10 candy. Everybody's talking about CP1. Y'all some assholes. Oh, really? You use candy to strengthen your Pokemon in this game? So they took all the shit from Pokemon Go, basically. This is the simplest Pokemon game that ever existed. Quick candy? And by depending on the number of Pokemon you actually send to Professor Oak uh, with this option, you're able to get a variety of candy. Wow. So this one is a quick candy you saw on screen there. Quick candy, health candy, mighty candy, tough candy. Also, it increases your stat. What? That's how you increase your stats? So this game is going to have a competitive feature. Wow. This is actually going to be competitive. So this way to strengthen your Pokemon, it's a system that's kind of unique to Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee. You didn't really see Yeah, you bring your Pokemon from Pokemon Go um, into Let's Go, and the Pokemon that you don't need, your trash, uh, Pidgeys and shit, you can get for candy and strengthen the IVs, excuse me, the EVs of the Pokemon of any Pokemon you want. So that's how it's going to work. I mean, I'm pretty sure you can still EV train or something. I don't know how the fuck it's going to work. I don't know. Maybe not. I don't know. So, yeah, and as you can see, I mean, I've been showing that all these different ways we want to make players just catch more and more Pokemon, and this is just another incentive to do that. And let's go Pikachu and let's go Eevee. Well, that's great. I mean, I'm personally very excited to be able to not only sit down and play Pokemon on my TV, but also to be able Oof. to play co-op with my own daughter. What a day. And introduce her to the Pokemon series as well. 
What a day. Damn, and that's not even over with. They got the tournament still, man. The tournament's going to be... I think Zero might lose. I think Mango's going to win the tournament because there's way down. <laughs> this is going to be crazy. I think Zero might lose. <laughs> I know, right? Well, here's the thing. Zero's actually good at melee, too, I heard. He's actually really good. But we're talking about Mango Nation. Fox McCloud. <laughs> and you know, if, if, if this is if this game is competitive, then that means their items are going to be off it's, and it's 1v1. So, dude, I'm, I'm getting teary out again. I can't believe how good this game's going to be in the future. Holy fuck, the tournaments. I'm going to play this competitive. I don't even care. I don't even fuck. I'm going to tournaments. I'm going downtown. I'm going to... The, I'm going to spend money on Lyft to go to these tournaments and get my ass beat just because I'm doing it, man. And I'm going to EVO. I'm going to EVO. I don't give a fuck. I'm drowning in the pools. So I'm going to EVO. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Sakurai is making this game for us and the competitive people. So why not support it? Fuck it. Let's do it. I'm going to do it. So one fun thing I have to announce for players in the I don't even know who I'm gonna meet. The show is that to kind of celebrate our uh, my main is still Pit, but I don't know, man. If if Simon's in there, I might have to drop Pit for us as a secondary. I don't know. But ever since Brawl Pit was my main, Smash 64, who was my main? Uh, Kirby Ness, I think it was Ness, and then in Melee was Samus, and then Young Link. Well, and then Brawl was Pit and Sonic, my, uh, my and, uh, <laughs> and then uh, Smash 4 was Pit and Dark Pit. <laughs> I cannot wait for these games, man. Fucking December the 9th, dude. December the 9th is D-Day. And I keep saying a Pokemon for everyone with Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee. And what I really mean by that is that with Pokemon Go, there are so many new players. Guys, don't forget, it's at New York. Of course, our long time the demo for is in New York. You know what? They could put a demo on the eShop because who are you going to fucking reveal? Every character's been shown. <laughs> I mean, sure, the newcomers, maybe they'll see Simon Belmont or whatever, but fucking, they could put it on the eShop at this point, who cares? They could definitely do it. They might, they might do it, though. Nintendo Treehouse Live will continue after a short break. We've got more games to come, and I'd like to thank everybody for tuning in. There was... Oh, but we have right? one more announcement oh, to make. That's though. right. I was forgetting. <laughs> yes. <laughs> People have been begging for Daisy since Melee. That this morning we did announce that in addition to Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Pokemon Let's Go Eevee and the Pokemon I'm mad though Daisy could get in but Waluigi still can't get in. That includes, uh, Damn, the man. It's okay. It's all right. It's a of who Wario? That's not gonna work. That's not gonna work. Echo characters are just clones, Anthony. That's just another word. That's just the official term for clone Echo character. So he can't be a clone of Wario. That's not gonna work. He has to be his own character. That's right. You can you can go on an adventure together. So, great. Thank you everybody for tuning in. They also didn't confirm like a fighter ballot thing, but there's still time. If they do a fighter ballot thing, there's still a, still a chance. There's still a chance. Okay, so they're going to be back with more stuff. Okay, so I'm going to end it off here. So that was Pokemon Go, guys. I'll be right back. Hold on one second. Uh, okay. So that was Pokemon Go. I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, they're going to be back, and I'm going to upload that as well. So let me know what you guys thought about that. Pokemon Go, po excuse me, Pokemon Let's Go e Pikachu looks great. Let's Go Pikachu Eevee and all. Let's Go. Pokemon Let's Go. Let's just say that. Looks good. I'm very excited. I can't wait to play it. Ah, oh, so cool, man. Look at the animations, dude. Oh, this is going to be so good. But yeah, I'm going to go off and end it here. So um, let me know what you guys think about that. 
the fact that it is going to be competitive because you can take your mons from go which you can basically get infinitely as long as you have a smartphone and play the game and catch pokemon you can then convert them to candy and you'll get infinite candy to put in your the po of any pokemon you want and there you go there's your ev draining so that's it it's perfect it's an actual competitive game unfortunately it's just you know the first 151 and they're probably never going to add the others until gen 8 comes out and then gen 8 i hope doesn't do this shit i'm pretty sure it's not going to do that shit where you have to do pokemon go but maybe it'll do that and still you have the ability to still ev train normally who knows we'll see all right i'm gonna end it off tell me guys what you think in the comment section below about pokemon go even though we were still talking about smash it's just gonna happen because i'm talking with my friends and they don't want me to leave them because they they brian oh you're so mean how could you leave us i understand I understand. Mainly Anthony. But anyway, <laughs> uh, let me know what you guys think about that in the comment section below. Uh, make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned for more videos. E3, craziness, let's plays, Wi-Fi, all that good jazz. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Oh, yeah, make sure, of course, you haven't already followed your boy, followed your boy on Twitter so you can stay updated with the Twitter things. Uh, Twitch so you can stay updated when I stream. And, of course, YouTube sort videos. All right. I'm in and off. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.